Hello, today is day three of our Advent book. We've been asked to think about traffic lights. We don't have any traffic lights here at the moment. We've had some roadworks over the last few weeks, but earlier this week, the last set of traffic lights were taken away. And so here I am in the centre of Camden, and later tonight, the Christmas lights are going to be switched on and they look spectacular as they run along um, the sort of gables and the roofs of all the houses up and down the high street. The book asks the question, when we look at traffic lights, what might they remind us of? The red might very obviously, you know, the stop might be sin and things that we should perhaps stop in our lives. The amber might be those things, you know, it's a warm colour, isn't it? You know, the light of Christ, um, fellowship around a, a fire. Um, green might be something to do with our care for the environment as we strive to be eco-churches, or might be something about the life everlasting that we're promised in Jesus. The thought today is as we drive around at this time of year, as we walk around, as we travel, we encounter lots of lights. What do those lights make us think of? How can they draw us deeper into our spirituality? Church is not something that we do for an hour on Sunday morning. Rather, our faith is something that we live out each day, each and every day, Sunday through Saturday. So let the lights be a reminder of the gospel. What do you think red would represent? What would amber represent? What would green represent? What do the Christmas lights around you represent?